14 parts of the human body that will disappear in the future. The first person to talk about the body parts that might go missing from the human body was no other than the father of the theory of evolution, Charles Darwin. He began the first chapter in his The Descent of Man, talking about a dozen different body parts that he describes as useless, or nearly useless. If he wasn't entirely confident that the body part was going to become redundant over the course of many different generations. Number 1. Body Hair Humans have tried to read themselves of body hair for centuries, probably ever since the first razor was discovered. Given that most body hair serves no function, exception for sexual attraction, it is entirely possible for a future generation of humans to not have any type of body hair. Number 2. The subclavius muscle. The subclavius muscle is a small muscle that stretches from under the shoulder from the first rib to the collarbone, just below the neck. The subclavius muscle is a small muscle that stretches from under the shoulder from the first rib to the collarbone, just below the neck. Number 3. Ear Muscles Did you know that such as rabbits and dogs, humans also have small muscles in their ears? While dogs have kept their ears fully mobile, humans can't really move them much, except for slight wiggling, which isn't really a useful thing to have. Number 4. The Neck Rib There is a set of cervical ribs, meaning in the neck area, that is a leftover from the age when reptiles ruled supreme. These ribs appear in less than 1% of the human population, however, they can cause problems for those that have them. Number 5. Wisdom Teeth Wisdom teeth got their name because they descend into the mouth around the age a person leaves puberty and becomes an adult, hence the name. However, for the most part, you didn't really need these teeth to help with chewing food. Number 6. Paranasal Sinuses there are millions of people around the world who have terrible problems with the sinuses. From frequent headaches to having a runny nose. The sinuses have proven to be entirely useless for nearly everyone on heart, which is why they might disappear someday. Number 7. The plantaris muscle. There is a long and narrow muscle, as shown in the above photo, that runs from the elbow to the wrist, and actually, a full 11% of humans already don't have that muscle. That would be a problem if those people would want to become rock climbers or martial artists one day. Number 8. Arector pili muscles. The arector pili muscles, as can be seen from the above picture, as small muscles that help animals puff up their fur so that they can better insulate themselves in the cold. Or they intimidate other animals by becoming larger in size. Humans have this ability but have sadly lost the fur. Number 9. Male nipples. Many people wonder why do guys have nipples, after all, men don't secrete milk, nor do they help feed the babies, apart from buying food in the supermarket. The reason men have nipples is that early on in the fetal developed, then barren child is essentially sexless, that is, without gender. Number 10. The Appendix The appendix is a well-known cause for several types of medical emergencies, which is why so many people have had to remove their appendix before it caused even more problems. The purpose of the appendix is to digest cellulose from plants. Number 11. Toes. Toes are another evolutionary leftover from our predecessors. According to a study, early humans used to balance their walking in the middle of their feet. But currently, the trend is shifting toward balancing more on the side of the big toe. Number 12. The 13th rib. The 13th rib that some people had, around 8% of adults by some estimations, is an evolutionary leftover from our closest genetical cousins, the chimpanzees and gorillas. Most people, on the other hand, have only 12 sets of ribs. Number 13. The Kekkuks. The Kekkuks is the medical term for what is known as the tailbone. The tailbone served as the foundation for the tail that most animals, including our predecessors, have. Given that humans have lost their tail, the tailbone is also going to disappear in the future. Number 14. Darwin's Point There is a small folded, point of skin that is on the top part of each ear, that is sometimes found in some humans, not all adults have this. According to scientists, that top part of the ear might be left over from a time when ears were larger and helped focus on distant sounds, 